Hundreds of people gathered tonight to mourn the loss of an Alta Loma High School sophomore. School officials confirm he was killed at a Halloween party last night. And tonight, investigators are still trying to figure out who shot him and why. NBC4's Hetty Chang, live in Rancho Cucamonga, where that sophomore went to school. Hetty? Colleen, we are just across the street from Alta Loma High School, where we learned tonight 15-year-old Robbie Plyley went to school there. This is also where tonight so many of his classmates are trying to deal and cope with an unthinkable loss. What started as a crowd of a few dozen quickly grew to a few hundred. Every person at Red Hill Community Park across from their school here to remember Robert Robbie Plyley, an Alta Loma High School sophomore whose friends say was universally loved. There's hundreds here because Robbie was a genuine good person. It's what he deserved. Savannah Medina says Robbie went to school every day with a single purpose. Robbie was an ambitious kid. He he loved to make everyone smile. His goal was to make a joke, at least to someone, to make them laugh. That yearning to make people smile? Well, everyone knew it. He was a, such a good kid, always had a smile on his face, always making people laugh. Late last night, about 20 miles east of Rancho Cucamonga on Geronimo Avenue in Bloomington, friends say Robbie was at this Halloween party where his school confirms the sophomore was shot and killed. A neighbor who does not want to be identified shared this video. She says she saw at least 300 people coming in and out of the house party. At about 1230, I would say there was a um, gunshot. One single gunshot is what we heard. <laughs> then we saw everybody running. He's dead. They have a gun. He's got a gun. And it was just like a stampede of kids running. It was actually very scary. The entire block this evening was still covered with evidence markers. Investigators taking photos of items people seem to have left behind in a hurry, like a backpack, some phone chargers, bottles of alcohol. Some at tonight's vigil say they had heard about the house party, but didn't know much about who had organized it or what led up to the shooting. He was just a good kid and, and at the wrong place at the wrong time. Now he's the angel watching over his family and all of his friends. We received a statement from the school district tonight describing Robbie as just a wonderful young man whose loss is being deeply felt. We know the district is also making grief counselors available. As far as the investigation, we're not getting much from the San Bernardino County Sheriff's Department. We do know they are still searching for the shooter. Live in Rancho Cucamonga tonight, Hetty Chang, NBC4 News.